folks, welcome to another episode of King Wheels. Pine and Farina Batista recently set several records among serial supercars. The Italian electric car hit 60 miles per hour in 1.86 seconds and 200 miles per hour in 4.75 seconds, making it the fastest supercar in the world, not counting hypercars. Now the Italian company has decided to demonstrate what its product is capable of on a quarter mile and half mile track, which are popular distances and have their own separate competitions in the modern automotive world. Batista proved that he is confident and able to impress many. Let's get to the results. Batista completed the quarter mile in 8.55 seconds, making it the fastest serial car in the world on that distance, just three tenths of a second faster than the Rimagne Veridid in 2021. The Italian supercar also completed the half mile in 13.38 seconds, showing similar results to the Rimagne Vera which is not surprising as Batista is built on the same platform as the Croatian hypercar and uses the same four-motor powertrain with 1,900 horsepower and 2,340 newton meters of torque. So it's no wonder that both supercars show similar results in dynamic tests. The Italian supercar's top speed is also impressive and it can easily reach 358 kilometers per hour on Michelin Pilot Sport Cup 2 tires. But if equipped with more extreme tires and prepared for higher speeds, it can easily surpass the 400 kilometers per hour mark. For this potential, the company asks for $2.2 million. BMW company is preparing for the upcoming premiere of the new generation of the 5 Series in the G60 body. This is relevant as recently. Mercedes revealed the interior of the new E-Class generation, which was well received. This means that two fierce competitors will change generations almost at the same time. Previously, the BMW 5 Series was scheduled to be presented by the end of 2023. But according to the latest information, it will happen much earlier. The premiere of the new 5 Series will take place in June of this year, which means we only have to wait a little over three months. BMW is already openly sharing technical information about the new generation of the 5 Series, the main highlight will be the electric i5 version, which will come in two configurations at the start of sales, a single-motor rear-wheel drive version i5 Drive 40 with a power output of 355 horsepower, and an all-wheel drive modification i5 M60 with two electric motors that will produce almost 680 horsepower. Later on, an intermediate's drive model with all-wheel drive and two motors producing almost 400 horsepower will be added to the lineup. Along with the electric version, the company will offer a traditional 5 Series with gasoline powertrains. Almost all of them will be hybrids, either mild or plug-in. Starting with the basic 5 Series, the 520i will be equipped with a 2-liter turbocharged 4-cylinder B48 engine producing 200 horsepower. The same engine will be used in the 530i version with an output of 267 horsepower. A 2-liter turbocharged diesel engine with a power output of 195 horsepower will also be available. For those who want more power, the Senior 540i version will use a 3-liter inline turbo 6B58 engine with a power output of 370 horsepower. The hybrid flagship modification M560 inches will use the same 3-liter inline turbo 6 engine combined with an electric motor with a power output of 571 horsepower and 800 newton meters of torque. The same powertrain is used in the BMW M760. 
the company will also offer a more affordable hybrid version of the 530i with a 2-liter turbocharged 4-cylinder engine and an electric motor. Its power output is not yet known. An all-wheel drive 550i version will be available for those who want something in between. Using a 3-liter inline turbo 6 engine combined with an electric motor producing 480 horsepower, the 3-liter diesel version will also be available. However, there is no information yet on their power characteristics. As mentioned earlier, the new 5 Series will be presented in June of this year, and the new sedan will be available for sale by the end of 2023. Well, that's all for today. Friends, subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any new videos, and don't forget about our Instagram page, which is available through the link in the description. Good luck to everyone and see you soon.